In this video, we're going to walk through the steps of setting up multiple cameras using Octoprint running Marlin firmware. Then we'll walk through the steps of adding multiple webcams to the Obico app so you can take advantage of Nozzle Ninja, Obico's new first layer AI. Nozzle Ninja utilizes a nozzle camera, a specialized webcam that gets a super up close view of the print. And Obico's first layer AI watches for first layer issues such as over extrusion, under extrusion, poor bed adhesion, bed leveling issues, and more. Then Obico sends you a first layer report and notifications via push notification or email. Well, let's get started. The first step is to SSH to the device that your Octoprint is running on, such as a Raspberry Pi. Now, we'll want to first remove the default webcam using the command sudo space remove dash USB dash camera space default. I've already done this, so it says camera does not exist. Next up, we'll want to add a new webcam using sudo space add dash USB dash camera space the name of your camera. I'll go ahead and add my standard USB webcam first, so I'll call it C270 for the Logitech C270, and it automatically assigned port 8081. Click 1 and enter to confirm this, and then go ahead and copy and paste the information that it provided you, such as the port device and configuration file somewhere else so you have that information later. Now let's go ahead and add another camera, so again sudo space add dash usb dash camera space camera name in this case it's the nozzle camera for me and now it's device two i'll also copy and paste that information for later as well now we just need to add one more piece of information to each configuration file so type sudo space nano space and then copy and paste the configuration file information from the first camera now we just need to paste a certain bit of information underneath options. It's going to be dash dash http dash listen equals 0 .0 .0 .0 0.0.0.0. Then enter control O to save and control X to escape. Now we're going to repeat that same exact process for the nozzle camera. So we'll do sudo nano followed by the configuration path for the nozzle camera. We'll paste the information, save and exit it. Then we'll restart camera streamer using the command shown. And now we should have a webcam stream available at port 8081 and another webcam stream available at port 8082. Looks great. Now go ahead and access Octoprint, go to the plugin manager, and we'll want to find the plugin classic webcam. We'll want to go ahead and disable this plugin. After that, restart Octoprint. Then install the multicam plugin if you don't already have it installed. Be sure to restart Octoprint after installing it. Go to the multicam plugin and enter a name for the first camera. Then enter the stream URL for the first camera and the snapshot URL for that camera as well. Next, do the same thing for the nozzle camera, this time with port. 8082. Now I have multiple webcams configured in Octoprint. Let's restart Octoprint and then configure multiple cams in Obico. First, go to the Octoprint settings and then go to Obico for Octoprint. Click settings and then you'll find a webcam section. Obico will automatically find the webcams used in the multicam webcam plugin. So just choose your USB webcam as the primary camera and your nozzle camera as the secondary camera. Then be sure to set the nozzle camera as the nozzle camera to, so it will work with the first layer AI. Restart Octoprint one more time and you should be good to go. Now you have multiple webcams configured in Obico and you can access either one or multiple streams at once. And that's it. You're now ready to get started with Nozzle Ninja, Obico's first layer AI.